I just want to appeal. Moments before receiving his sentence, Paulson Papillon made his intentions known. He plans on appealing the jury's conviction for his role in the 2015 shooting death of Michael Pittman. And while Pittman's widow did not appear in court due to health reasons, she did have a statement read on her behalf. When I think of this crime, I can't help but think it was all for nothing. My husband had misplaced loyalty toward you and all the people involved in this crime. What kind of person can sit and casually plan to have a man murdered? You have to live with this. Papillon may not have been the trigger man, but a jury found him guilty of plotting Pittman's murder. On November 3rd, 2015, Pittman was shot outside his Douglas Street apartment. It's a night that, according to the statement by Pittman's widow, has taken an emotional toll on their children. Well, my daughter, who was 13 at the time of the murder, saw her stepfather dying on the steps of our home. She still doesn't feel safe and suffers from nightmares. I sentence you as recommended by the state. Today, Papillon received 10 to 33 years in prison for second degree murder and 10 to 30 years for conspiracy to murder. Well, it's a just and appropriate sentence, and we would not have gotten here without all the hard work from Manchester police. This was really investigators that made this case. Now, Papillon is the fourth person convicted in this case. Adrian Stilwell, who actually pulled the trigger, was convicted of first degree murder. Two other men, Nathaniel Smith and Michael Young, accepted plea deals in exchange for their testimony. Live in studio, Mike Cherry, WMUR News 9.